I do want to talk about whether we're even going to get a GTA 6 online. So let's yeah, not- What? Hey, yo, there is no way, bruh. What's up, my Toxic Gamers? What's up, my GTA Plus members? Bruh. Hopefully none of you folks actually bought a GTA Plus. We're going to be talking about GTA 6 online. Or is it going to be GTA Online 2? Boy, if you don't get this is coming from TGG. He's old and reliable, right? I can trust this guy with my life, but definitely not my wife though. Bruh. Like and subscribe. We're gonna get into the story. I'm also doing a giveaway for the PlayStation and Xbox gift card. If you're interested, check out the top pin comment, enter in, and uh, let's check this time. Out. Let's jump straight into it. So, dude, what on earth am I talking about? Okay, let me explain. Yeah, you can, well, as everyone in the community knows, it's not called Grand Theft Auto 5 Online, is it? I mean, that's what some people call it, but that's wrong. It's just called Grand Theft Auto Online. So okay. picture yeah, this. Yeah, Rockstar yeah. announces GTA 6, GTA 6 comes out, whatever. What would happen to GTA Online? Do they just scrap GTA Online and call this new online game GTA 6 Online? I mean, look, yeah, possibly they could call yeah. it GTA 6 Online, but how many people would get confused between GTA 6 Online and- Okay, uh, ding, 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 time out real quick. So you're telling me and telling everybody that people's IQ is this low to the point where they're not gonna be able to differentiate from this, why did I move here? I guess it was the weather. GTA Online version to possibly like that get tapped out over the Lucia Bruna with Miami, with the palm trees, GTA 6 Online. I mean, come on, man. Like, come on, man. Stop saying people are stupid like that, dog. Like, come on, dog. They can keep this circuit going as well. Just like how Call of Duty comes out every single year. One after another, another one, and another one, and another one, okay? Like, damn, bro. They, they can keep this going, okay? Like the video if you agree. Like, keep GTA 5 Online going. Uh, and uh, also have GTA 6 online. I mean, problem solved. Pineto, problem go, go, solved, bro. Go, go, go. GTA online. Do you see what I'm saying here? This is where the water starts to get a bit muddy. Look, they could even go down the path of what Call of Duty Warzone did and yeah. launch Call of yeah. Duty Warzone 2.0. Rockstar could come out and say, we're launching GTA online 2.0. Who knows? No, 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 they no, no, could no, no. Even... <laughs> Pump the brakes, dog. Uh, we don't want GTA Online 2, bro. GTA Online 2 is... If they do something like that, bro, I'm gonna be doubting it to the point where I'm gonna probably assume that it's gonna be like GTA 5 Plus or GTA 5 Remaster, 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 Remaster. Re... Remaster. Bruh. With the new engine upgrade with the GTA 6 graphics. Although I would love a thing where... Let's say, okay... And one in the comments if you agree, two if you disagree. If they do GTA 6 online, or I don't care what they call it, as long as we have the new map to play on for GTA 6 online and new stuff. Okay, we have that. And on top, as a bonus, as a cherry on top, you also include the GTA 6 online. Oh my or God. Online, oh I should my say. God. Yeah, exactly. GTA 5 online. GTA 5 online. Los Santos alongside Miami Vice City. Like the video if you agree. I think that would be, that would be a banger though. Even come out and say we're launching something called GTA World. And it's just going to be a never-ending Fortnite-like style updating map over time. And down the line, you know, when GTA... And we had leaks about it, like, uh, years ago from the homie Tom Henderson, who also leaked the Lucia Bruna. For, uh, he was the first guy to leak it, right? And he did say that, yeah, over time, we're going to be getting expansion. So, I actually like that. I like this idea. I know that some people will like, nah, bruh, we don't want no Fortnite updates. But when you really think about it, GTA Online has been getting updates. Yes, yeah, slower than uh, what it used to be. But when GTA 6 comes out, we're going to be seeing more frequent updates, at least in the very beginning, at least for, like, the first two days decades right because we're not getting the next gta game anytime soon we're gonna be we're gonna be years old dog like we're gonna we're 80 years old probably we might not even be alive let's be real gta 7 gta 8 comes out decades in the future instead of launching hey, yo, new online games they would just in theory port those maps over to this gta online but who's to say that this isn't already their plan with the current gta online because something that not many uh, people all of us right now wrong, wrong. 
people actually know happened in 2021, I believe, when GTA 5 and GTA Online came to the current gen consoles, yeah, GTA Online actually became a standalone game. Yeah, a lot of people don't know this. You don't need GTA 5 to have GTA Online anymore. They are now completely separated. So let's say GTA 6 launches in 2024. Is Rockstar really gonna <laughs> abandon- <laughs> Pump the brakes, dog. It turns out, I mean, listen, man. I'd be like that too, boys. It is launching in 2025. And, and for this one, you really gotta sit down, guys, because we recently had a leak. I will, you, that was my last GTA 6 video. I will link you at the end because, guys, uh, sit down, kiss your loved ones goodbye. I don't want you guys uh, falling, falling and knocking yourselves out because there are new leaks going around that says that GTA 6 is gonna be coming up by the end of 2025. Oh, shit. So, we're like two years away from that thing right now. If that really happens, I mean, it's Joe or Brad. Like, I'll become a monk and settle myself on a mountain in Tibet. What mountain? I'm not sure. Bruh. We're gonna figure it out as we go, okay? We, we still have a year plus, okay? If the game doesn't come out early 2025, we're gonna figure out... I'm gonna figure out... Uh, or we, we gonna figure out, right, guys? Come on, man. Like, come on, bro. Like, I don't wanna go alone, right? Like, we, we gonna figure this out. We can, you know, find a mountain in Tibet and, yeah, we can go go there and become monks, you feel what I'm saying? Because there would be no point after that, you know what I'm saying? And this is gonna absolutely, like, knock your socks off. This is a clownry pro max. Check this out. I have to zoom on, but we have one guy who says that why on earth would anyone want to play in Los Santos when Vice City's up? Absolutely, big W, I agree. Another guy in the same, like, you know, sp uh, one hour span says that they have to keep Los Santos. I spend real money there and I'm used to that city. Oh my god. Ow. Oh. Bruh. My bad, I had to cycle through memes right there, guys. And in GTA Online, just two or three <laughs> years after it became a standalone game? I mean, look, yeah, maybe they did a somewhat similar thing with Red Dead Online. And to be clear, yes, I actually hope this is what happens. I hope Rockstar leaves the current GTA Online behind because I don't want to press yeah. a Mark II's. But, but listen, man, GS Smoke 3 TV, he says that they have to keep Los Santos. He spent real money there and he used to the city though. That's a problem, you know what I mean? Oh. What the homie's gonna do, man? He spent real money and he used to the city, bruh. He don't want to be used to new city because like, listen, man, playing GTA 6 online would be like, you know, how you move houses, <laughs> how you move apartment. Like if you live in, let's just say New York, right? I'm in Montreal. So I live in Montreal. It's going to be like me moving from Montreal to New York. It's a completely new, new city. I spend real money here, man. I have my apartment here. I'm used to the city, bruh. bruh. I don't want to be used to another city, dog. Bruh. I mean, damn, what are we talking about here, bro? Like, it's just a game, dog. It's just a new man, bro. You're going to be used to it real quick. And guys, do not buy GTA Plus, okay? And like the video, like the video. stuff flying around Subscribe when if you GTA agree. 6 launches. I personally want a completely new online experience Same. where we have to start fresh. But I do want to set expectations in place so that people aren't disappointed if this is actually... Uh, uh, too late, bro. We already disappointed, dog. ...actually the case. That is, if Rockstar does doesn't launch a completely new online and instead just updates and overhauls the current GTA Online. Yeah. But you might say to that, well, TGG, GTA Online has GTA 5's graphics. It's way outdated. I don't want GTA- Dog, it is actually crazy that we are now like uh, thinking that is it, is it gonna be a new GTA <laughs> Is it gonna be new GTA 6 online or is it gonna be old? Gaming is just insanely in a sad state right now. I think most of you watching this video, I mean jokes aside and you know real real uh, conversation here, I think most of you understand, most of you know, even I know that we're gonna be getting a new map, right? But what if, what if, right? Because uh, these rumors are blowing, uh, going around, the homie TGG is talking about it too. And the homie TGG is somebody that, uh, you know, he's old and reliable. I can trust him with this information. I can trust him with my life. Definitely not my wife though, because you know what I'm saying? Like things can happen. Shy 
can happen, so I cannot trust him uh, with my imaginary wife. I don't have a wife right now, because, uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm a loner. Uh, right now, right now, right now, as not just the pom pom, in the future, uh, I will have my own football team, I will have my own soccer team, you know, um, a new kid every year, okay? We're gonna do Bruh. that uh, in the future, right? Not right now, like, times are busy, we gotta talk about GTA 6, we gotta play this game before, uh, before that, right? Before that, so uh, I, I wanna uh, put time aside for this game, right? And hopefully, we stay alive till uh, 2025, guys. Start eating healthy and smash the like button, drink water, eat your vegetables. GTA 6 right now. to come out, and stay then alive, boys. we're still running around with the old GTA 5 mechanics within GTA Online and has GTA 5's graphics. It's way outdated. I don't want GTA 6 to come out, and then we're still running around with the old GTA 5 mechanics within GTA Online. And yeah, yeah agreed, I completely agreed. agree, but what we also have to recognize is that developers nowadays have been doing this sort of thing where they upgrade the engine, upgrade the graphics, instead of actually launching a completely new game. And we don't have to look any further than Fortnite. If you haven't played Fortnite in a while, the entire game has been ported over to the upgraded version of the Unreal Engine. Mm -hmm. And there have been reports that Rockstar with GTA 6's online version want to emulate Fortnite with a constantly upgraded- Yeah, so this is 2018 and this is like 2023. This is the- Dog, I don't- <laughs> I don't see that big of a difference though, other than, yeah, like, it's kind of like the same Burna as well though, let's be real. <laughs> Guys, I'm just pointing out the obvious, I'm just, before you say bro's telling the obvious, because yes, I'm telling the obvious right now, dog. like, it's looking the same. Uh, the grass is a little bit different, but yeah, I, I guess this is from a YouTube video, so it's hard to tell if you play, it's a little bit different, I mean, and I, I gotta be honest, right, like, a lot of devs do that, even Call of Duty did that, like, they ported Warzone 2, Warzone 2, Call it 2.0, made, like, another map, and called it a day, right, and that was it, that was it. So maybe they're gonna do the same thing. Maybe they're gonna do the same thing. But the question remains, is it gonna be a Los Santos map or is it gonna be a new map, right? I, I know the, the homie TGG got me sus right now, though. He got me sus. I'm blaming TGG right now. Though. World, upgrading map, and map expansions over time. So who's to say that this isn't one of the reasons that GTA 6 has been taking so long? This is, of course, just a theory, but I mean, if Rockstar had to make an entirely new GTA 6, as well as a new GTA 6 Online, as well as port the current Los Santos and GTA Online over to the upgraded Rage engine. Yeah. Dog, they have to make a new GTA game, bro! They gotta make a new GTA, and they are making a new GTA game. Like, why are we like, hey, bro, like, uh, if Rockstar making GTA this and that, dog like they they gotta make and they are but i like this idea that hey okay have a new game and they are uh, and, and uh, don't do like gta online 2 okay please just make a new gta online and let gta 5 online run like it's running okay just leave it as is uh, obviously the hackers issues I'm not sure if they're fixed on the PC or not but on console it's kind of odd right now I I don't play that much so I don't know that much uh, for sure but the uh, but, but I'm hearing it's fine on console, but on PC it can be problematic. Uh, fix that crap, okay? But <laughs> leave it as is and make GTA 6 Online brand new. Completely brand new with Miami, with Lucia Burda, and, uh, you know, we can have all the get as well. Uh, yeah, 100%. But alongside that, I think it would be cool if we get GTA... Uh, five Los Santos map as well. Bruh. I'm saying as a bonus, okay, as a bonus, uh, where we have new map plus we can, you know, maybe take a plane and you know go uh, to the ocean and then all of a sudden, boom, we have GTA Five map, right? I think it would be actually pretty good. Yeah, that kind of makes like and subscribe if you agree. Makes sense why it's been over ten years since we've got a new GTA. Okay, TGG, but you pulled that out of your ass. You know absolutely nothing. That's complete speculation. Yeah, yeah agree, that's true. But if GTA Online becoming a standalone game wasn't a big enough reason to convince you that yes this could actually be a possibility again i don't yeah. i mean he making a compelling point and compelling argument with the actual like gta online and not gta 5 online i do have to give him that and i do agree with this point specifically but but but, but are they really gonna call it gta 6 online or gta online 2 
That's the question because they cannot call it GTA Online or maybe or maybe they are gonna call it GTA Online but like you mentioned in the very beginning that if the new GTA Online is called GTA Online then obviously like a lot of people would be confused right <laughs> yeah he Loki said that people are dumb people are stupid stupid that's what he he was saying and I guess it kind of makes sense because if GTA 5 Online is called GTA Online and if GTA 6 Online is also gonna be called GTA Online then that's gonna be a problem Problem, though you feel what I'm saying not for us not for you single chads out there because like a lot of you are uh, kind of like understanding of the situation but about what about little Timmy what about little Timmy right I don't want it to be but it could be let me give you some more reasons over the past couple years Rockstar GTA Games Plus. launched GTA yeah. Plus this gives players a bunch of bonuses within GTA online yeah, he put that picture behind my face cam right there so GTA Plus yeah as well as gives them access to the Vinewood Club what is the Vinewood Club well it gives you access to the Vinewood Car Club, where you can buy vehicles that otherwise wouldn't be available in the in-game websites, as well as, coming this December, access to a 100 car garage. Rock 100 car garage. Can a brother get that for free? Like if you agree, dog. Cause listen, man, GTA Plus, bro, this second is gonna make a return in GTA. Six online, okay? They're gonna do it. A hundred car garage as a brown man, I instantly demand for GTA Plus to be free. I'm not saying this continue the service all i'm saying is that make it free for everybody everybody deserves to get gta plus for free all my homies all my nibbas should be getting this second for free absolutely as a brown man i demand for the shark cards to be removed immediately from the game as a brown man i demand gta 6 online to be good as a brown man i demand gta 6 to actually be good as a brown man i also demand no nerf to the burners uh but if the burner is gonna be taking like 100 gigs uh, of space then uh, maybe like two percent uh nerf Bruh. reduction and the rest we can actually deal with it it's gonna be fine Star has also said that they will be continuing to add to the Vinewood Club with every single GTA Online update. Would Rockstar really be fleshing out this entire system if they plan on canning GTA Online in the next year when GTA 6 comes out? Again, I mean, look, yes, maybe there is a chance that they could be planning to do that. But in my opinion, it would be kind of strange. Okay, how about this? <laughs> Just this year, only six months ago, Rockstar Games added in the career progress feature in GTA mm. Online. This gives you- Man, they added so much, I don't even know. Like, I, I, I played GTA Online uh, just a couple of days ago and it felt very, very strange. It was ridiculously hard after seeing like the Lucia Brunas and all the get on the map and the graphics, the 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 CGI gameplay, cinematic trailer, whatever you want to call it, right? I, after seeing the graphics, it, it was very, very hard to play GTA Online, man. And GTA 5 is a very good game, in my opinion, of course. Bruh. In my opinion, of course. And, uh, uh, yeah, like, but it was very, very hard. And I gotta say, like, there's so much stuff in the game that's added over the years. And more than half of it, I just don't even know. Because I, uh, I played GTA Online for, I believe, the first two years. After that, I kind of stopped playing it. I would play here and there, right? Obviously, I've done, like, most of the heists, but definitely not all the heists. Uh, I'll finish the campaign, but I played most of the GTA Online in the very, very beginning, right? It's This game has been out for a decade plus, though. The next GTA 6 Online, I really hope that it stays fresh for, like... It's probably gonna stay fresh for at least the first three years after that. It's gonna slow down, I think. Uh, but but GTA is one of those games that is gonna... That is an evergreen, right? Suck is gonna be buying it every single year, but... When are we gonna get GTA 7? Bruh. Is Sernando actually playing it right now? Yo, Sernando, hit us up in the leaks, kid. Specific challenges for almost every single activity in the game. Every business has its own set of challenges. Every contact mission, every adversary mode, race, that type of stuff. These take a really, really long time to complete. Like a really long time. I play oh, this man. game as my job. And over the past six months, I've only completed eight of these career progress things. If you complete five of these, you'll get an outfit. You'll get another outfit if you complete 10 of them, 15, 20, and 25 of them. I only know Duh. one person who has actually completed. It's like having a second job, bruh. What's Call of Duty skill based magic and not enough? That now we gotta have this man. Now this gaming gaming is like doing a job right now, bro. I would say the finals is good. Fortnite, sadly, I have to say, I know some of you will disagree, but Fortnite is actually pretty, pretty fun as well. <laughs> 
yeah, guys, I mean, if a game is fun, the game is fun, right? Simple as that. Uh, and GTA is my beloved franchise, though. Uh, and, and they had it so much crap that half of it I don't understand, and most of it is just uh, asking for you to open up your wallets, buy microtransactions, and get those shark cards, and instead of playing, they they purposely make the the grind painful. That's the part I don't like. I love grinding in games, but not like you know, over exaggerating to the point where y you're making the grind actually painful. That 25 I, I don't like. So, did Rockstar really launch this feature in 2023? Something that would genuinely take thousands of hours for players to complete if they were planning on ending support for GTA Online yeah. at the end of 2024 or early 2025 when GTA 6 comes out. Like the mm. other topics we've spoke about. Possibly, but in my opinion, this one in particular would be very, very strange. Yeah, guys, remember I'm doing this, this giveaway. Enter before it's over. Check out the top pin comment. And this is that video. This is that video where we actually talk about GTA 6. We had the brand new leaks that says that the game might be coming out by the end of 2025. Oh, shit. We had brand new leaks. Check this video out.